That which he learned at the feet of his mother would serve as a spiritual foundation that would never falter. Carrying him through the 35 years he served as a general authority for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Though Howard Hunter had a desire to be baptized a member of the church, permission was not granted by his father, William. As a result, Howard's 12th birthday came and went, and he was unable to pass the sacrament with the other deacons in the ward. Howard repeatedly begged his father for permission, and finally on April 4, 1920, Howard and his sister Dorothy were baptized in the large indoor swimming pool in Boise. Eleven weeks later, Howard was ordained a deacon by his bishop, Alfred Hoganson. Of his first time passing the sacrament, President Hunter recorded, I was frightened, but thrilled to have the privilege. After the meeting, the bishop complimented me on the way I had conducted myself. 